pilot that they plan to submit to studios. How about that? Now, Wynn joins us live from Free Flow Academy in Rockland with a sneak peek of the finished piece. Hi, Nat. Yeah, it's so cool. The kids have been working so hard for the last 12 weeks. They've finished it. They've created the, the trailer, and they are screening the full hour-long pilot this weekend. But before we get to you, I wanted to mention storyboarding. It's a big part of the process as well. We have James here who's been here helping everybody along. How many scenes did you help create, and how does storyboarding uh, help in this process? We, we did about four or five scenes. Uh, the, how it helps the process is when you storyboard, it helps the filmographer match up to the script and gets everything prepped ahead of time so that you can cut down your film time. I love it. So I wanted to show, we've been talking about all morning, can you guys pull up the trailer? The trailer is so cool. This is the first one they're, they've shot. They're actually in the process of doing a couple more. So uh, L, one of the co-founders of Free Flow was saying it makes it look really dramatic and scary, but it's actually also a comedy. If you were to think of it in terms of genre, it's uh, in the vein of, she said, Japanese anime and then Western Kung Fu Western, and there she is. So I want to talk to her real fast about what the process has been like for everybody. Um, well, the last 12 weeks have been crazy. We've had uh, so much work ahead of us, but um, we've really just kind of come together. Everybody wore so many different hats. We had actors helping with makeup, with camera. Um, we had stunt players holding the boom mic. Cool. So we just like all collaborated and we all got to wear different hats. Um, we've all been editing and color correcting and just. Um, doing a whole bunch of things and just seeing the process from beginning to end um, but everybody's kind of seeing what everybody else's job is which is also like a, a huge thing for these artists and athletes to see and I think it's so cool that they're getting to do this at such a young age developing these skills so that when they get to a point I mean they could do it now really in Hollywood they could start working but to really develop those skills and if they want to be their own person their own creator learning all those things and I want to point out something very important you mentioned to me was that you guys ended up doing the casting, pulling everybody in, you don't need experience. No, this is um, totally, like, you can be a beginner level, never done this before. We welcome um, beginners as, as long as you have a desire to, you know, start creating some content and learning about this stuff. We want you on our team and we want you helping us create content because it's all about just building a community as well as building an industry right here in our own backyard. I love it. I love it when we create things here in Sacramento and then yeah. send them out knowing what they need to do. So if you're interested, this is the first time they've done it, and it won't be the last time. They'll do it every year. They're also doing a small one uh, for our PBS kids. They plan to submit to them in April. If you guys are interested in taking part in that, go ahead and reach out to them. I know all the info may, uh, popped up on the screen. Hopefully, if not, it'll be up on our website under show info. We'll send it back to you guys. All right, now, thank you. What an incredible opportunity for those kids.